Greetings, hello and welcome back to the army of, well, uh, more than four today. Again, I, I'll keep doing that. Every time it's more than four soldiers, it's like, oh, it's not army of four, it's army of six. Anyway, um, we have retaliation time one, once again. And it seems like the game is somehow being nice to me. First of all, there's no instant activation here. Second of all, if it's not too far away from the from the main squad, um, <clears throat> right? We don't have any concealment, so I, the good news is we are in the corner, so we're not gonna have to wonder. Oh, I'm gonna have enemies on the left, on the right. Probably just gonna be in the front and somewhere on the left here. Then I assume maybe a group back here, maybe something back here. I think I want to do the usual thing. So the problem is... I care about this. Normally, um, on, on most inter radiations, I'm, I'm very often saying, yeah, I don't, I don't care. If, if we lose the device, no big deal. Um, can't do intel for a while. But that's the whole idea of this region, is running intel, finding missions. So... More like we have 15 rebels in this region, I think, if I remember correctly. So we can kind of... I, I don't want to say sacrifice one, but hey. Um, if something happens, something happens. Okay. Sergeant Gunner. What are you? Another Gunner. Guardian. And a mech who's looking at us very, very aggressively. First things first, who can you see? You see that guy, but he's in cover and you see the mech. How far can you go? Yeah. Not super far. Um, you have ninety nine percent to hit him, which would give you an implacable move. Hey, Like ideally we wanna take take apart as many of these guys here as possible. So I'm thinking God getting getting to these guys is gonna be an an issue. Well, hang on. You have a running gun. My new favorite sniper skill. So you could literally move here, activate running gun, activate double tap, and take down the guardian and then Probably the first sergeant. The nearest high ground is this little billboard. Alright, let's do that. Good hit. Not a kill. Um, what do we have here? Even anyone? Anyone with special skills? You have ever vigilant? Interesting. Peace. 
to start. Shame, shame, shame. Just gonna just gonna burn this guy a little bit. Worth a try. Make him ex extra crispy. Well, or not. So it was worth a try, as he said. Do I get to this gunner? That's the real question here. And how many of my utility items do I want to use in, in turn one? All right. Um, okay, I think here's, here's part of the plan. Gonna put an A protocol on our favorite butt spot. And we do a zappity zap on that guy. Okay, this allows you to get the whiplash. It's all there. Okay, two shots. But you only need one. Being fundamentally better sours the taste of victory. So you have Overwatch now. So if I run you here, a flank on the gunner. The gunner is hopefully gonna have a bad day. And just, you know, Come on, guys. just to, to hammer down the message here. Okay. I'm going to bring you in with Ever Vigilant. Uh, it's just, you know, get, get all in there. Got it. But never Overwatch. I'm already positioning myself with cover to wherever else the enemy is my job. Actually, yeah, this is this is wrong here. Right. You should go there. Roger that. Hey, kind of want to go there, but I'm also really uh, resistant on going over any further to the left. Don't want to activate anything, so let's just uh, just creep up a little, and you creep up a lot. I'm all over it. I'm on it. It's dead as requested. Okay. Yeah, I'm hearing snaky sounds, yeah. Let's look over there. Closing on target position now. What do we have? Squad disguised signals. So we could get everybody it concealed here. Um and uh, Fairly certain Rattler has the better the better hacking role than Bud Spot. For now I think we're just gonna just gonna chill a little bit, overwatch steady weapon with Jason and see if something comes up. We need to stick together. Comes up from the gutter from the sewers there. I'm ready! I'm 
I'm going. I've got the thing. Definitely a chance that a group from back here starts shooting the device soon, so we can't just chill around for five turns. I said you can chill for one turn. Heading out. Got it covered. And I want you further, further over here. So we'd like you to be in some sort of full cover, but I guess we can't have that. Maybe here. Get moving. So I can attack anything okay. that passes by. Got it covered. I can handle it. Moving to Overwatch. Okay. Overwatch, come get some. Okay, they were further down the road, so we're gonna have a flank on a bunch of the rebels here. What do we have? Two snipey snakes, a berserker. Grenadier and a what? Advanced trooper. Okay. Fire's getting worse here. Well, the good news is nobody took shot. So we could run you in there to flank both of these snakes if we can take down the grenadier with obviously the berserker and have something, something to say to the trooper. Although I guess at least you'd be in cover here. Like the trooper is here, I just don't see him right now. You see the grenadier, you see the berserker. Can you get in range of the berserker? Absolutely not. Uh, one tile off. Maybe if this guy moves away. Seems doable. Seems doable. He, he, the, the, she's capable of moving. I'm accidentally, uh, actually, super surprised. Um, what are we doing here? Okay, thirty-three percent. Probably still don't want to do this. Although map alert is not the worst effect that can happen. So maybe... Yes. Let's see, if you move there and then grapple, how far can you get? You can't get on this roof. Can't get a flank on the grenadier. Alright, so we might have to just command for another move, grapple up, pew pew the grenadier. Uh, before I use my first action, let's actually make sure that we can see you for a command and that we don't have the light post in the way. It wouldn't be the first time. Would not be the first time. Um... If I... If I... Eight protocol you you get an overwatch but that's i don't care if the overwatch triggers against the snakes that's really not much value so maybe i don't need it back here all right 
Let's, let me check this first here. Yeah. Can you grenade this guy? Yes. Maybe that plus the rebels can actually take him down. That was big damage. That was really big damage. Okay, so since we're using grenade liberally on single targets, we've got to start air dropping. And look very, very serious while doing that. Split second, I was very concerned about activating something else back here, but nah, we're fine. We're fine. Especially fine if this kills. Would be a little bit finer if that actually hit. That's definitely all the outcomes that could have happened, that was a shot. So we don't get the extra move to move you for a flank. You're also not untouchable, which is probably the bigger, the bigger concern here. How do you not see the Grenadier from here? What? Oh, this box is in the way. No, anyway. If you can hit there. Ugh. I'm low on ammo. I like this. Ugh. I still think I got. I just gotta run you um, for a sneaky flank here on the snakes. Solid copy. You've got a 78 on the trooper. That certainly helps. Okay, the snakes can't move and shoot, so they are actually not a threat right now, so I think I can just Moving. move up and shoot. Actually, yeah, if he has loot, that would be very sad. Did I move you there and then nothing happened? Okay, so basically the rest here is between these two rebels and Xanthalos. They can they can deal with the snakes. Um, we're gonna focus on whatever was making sounds over here. As you wish. Seems doable. Oh yeah. Move into position. Does this thing have better hack trolls? Yeah. Okay. I'll monitor that. Area. Got it covered. On Overwatch. Overwatch. This of it. I scared him. here. That is not good. I think that Chrysalid's plan was to attack the device, as in a unactivated pot action, where you know they sometimes shoot the device. And this time it was just a Chrysalid who's like, oh, I'll, I'll melee the device. Ooh, that Lancer did not have a good time. The integrity of this machine is failing. 
thankfully, that shield bearer made a really poor cover choice. Ah, oh, and there's the rest. Okay. Okay. A little bit concerned about... Um, I think we have flanked on our Grenadier. But thankfully, they didn't take any shots. Oh, no, he's far enough, far enough away. Oh, this thing is blocking down the side. One of the things. All right. Definitely going to overdrive here. Probably blow up half the gas station. Like the the fairly certain the shield barrel is back here on that spot. So if I can blow up this gas pump, this gas pump, which blows up that vehicle, that should take care of a lot. Two sniper snakes here we wanna flank if possible. Might be a command on you. Uh, or teamwork to just get behind them. Different enemies. Well, two of them are these snakes here. And I'm, I'm actually wondering if we just... play keep away with Kofi here. Go, go, go. And maybe Xen can help out over on this side. We blow up this thing. We might get Lana's side on the mutant from up here. Might wanna get these guys away from the cars and the and the gas tanks. You know, come in here. I'm, I'm gonna abuse the fact that Najas can't do anything while flanked. Or won't do anything while flanked. Like, it shouldn't chain react over here, right? This car is not next to this gas pump. What's kind of the explosion radius of a gas pump? Two tiles? Yeah, this is fine. Who has the weakest weapon? Yo. Uh, here's a question, Jason. Do you have any... All your shots are kind of crap. So I'm thinking... Thank you, you're gonna teamwork and just steady up here. Or maybe even better than steady. Move up to grapple, but I don't know if you can actually grapple from here, so no, that's steady. So you can double move and then throw a nice grenade. Okay. Um Rock and roll. I wanna, I wanna get this out of the way. This is for you. Oh, that was my discord. Uh, let me, just, let me just mute that. Professional, professional YouTuber here. Always forgets to um, disable the notification sounds. You're telling me I can't see this mutant who's out in the open from up here, even though there's nothing left in the way. That seems like a far-fetched... Seems like bullshit, that's what I'm trying to say. I can see him from down here. Hmm. 
could move there, and then get a command, and then move up. Well, on the bright side, this gave me line of sight to pretty much anything else. I see the gunner, I see this guy. Okay, alright, alright. I need to go at least four, five tiles closer. Now, let's go here. I want to be. They tell me I can't hit the. If I hit the fuel pumps, I'm not hitting the mutant. Ah. Right. This is fine. So much good to destroy it. That's my soul. Okay, then I have one more shot. Ooh, but you have a shot at the heavy lancer here. Yes. Just a really long range. Well, 83 will take that. This challenger's death was especially intriguing. I'm not sure what I do about this gunner. Oh, but no, that's actually the easy part of all of this. Going in for the kill. What is it? <laughs> Can't. Hmm. Okay. Um, let's use our last command on top of that running gun and on top of that teamwork. Five actions or a ton of mobility and we go all the way over here. That flanks this snake, flanks the other snake that I don't see right now. And should allow us to rapid fire the gunner. Who's that? Oh, the elite trooper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Taking care of. Good thing I rapid fire before the the first shit, shit shot <laughs> only hit for uh, insane amounts of damage. Um. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I understand. Seven active enemies. Four are snakes that are flanked, that don't do anything. Elite Trooper, Mutant, who's number seven? Where's the stats? Oh, someone is still down there. Someone is still down there. You barely can get not, a, not get a flank on this guy. Okay. All right. So I'm thinking. I'm gonna try the fire grenade here. That's what I need to use. A burn. Wonderful. And then you're just gonna you're a pretty decent beta. And you should be untouchable right now because you got the kill on the Lancer. So I'm just gonna go down there, bait the guy who's down below. Shit. 
So... Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna have a little bit of an injury problem after this. Purifiers have... Um, or advanced purifiers. And elite purifiers have whatever it is that ignores immunities. And that also counts for untouchable. So he's actually gonna do proper damage. He shouldn't be able to set me on... Uh, to burn me? I'm actually not sure. Since I'm not immune to burn, I'm just immune to the first attack, but he ignores immunities. I don't know. Like, this is... This is one of the reasons why I really don't like Phosphorus on Purifiers. I didn't, I didn't, I knew that someone was down there, but I forgot that it was a purifier, or maybe I didn't actually see him long enough. Look, hard to keep track of ten enemies. Come get some. So, we continue to play keep away with ten snakes, uh, with four snakes, yeah? They're running in different directions now, though, so that's a little bit more tricky now. Miracle that you were able to see it anyway and take a shot. Oh. Do advanced purifiers not have? Not even close. Spurs yet? Are you gonna unburn yourself? That's it. This this mission is full of surprises. Um. Seriously, you have. I am 100% certain that I had purifiers damage soldiers that were untouchable in the past. Now I'm not just slightly confused here what's, wh why this in this case didn't apply. Get you over there. Best blow it up. That that's the spirit. Hey, you have the man, best blow it up. I mean, if I had actually, ooh, check. Let's let's take the kill. We don't need the ammo. Took down another. Need some ammo. It's the sergeant. Let's go. All right, who's left alive? Um, two snakes back here. Jason, you got any shots? Nope. I do want to see if I can get you to get line of sight for combat protocol for that one HP snake all the way over there. No, can't be bothered. I'll comply can be bothered, however. Kill you. If we can kill these two this turn, we're not gonna have to deal with reinforcements, which would be kind of sweet. You know that was good. I'm running low on ammo. I'm surprised that this snake basically flanked itself here. Coming. Well, that worked. 
down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. So I'm wondering if the purifier run that I had was with an assault with actual untouchable and that maybe battlefield awareness works differently than that. I am I'm, I'm, I'm confusion right now. Or maybe that behavior was changed. I was like, I've just killed Purifier always. I've never had this situation come up again since, I want to say, three years ago in the Long War of the Chosen Beta still. Um, just after Purifier's got Phosphorus in the first place. Today is a minor footnote in history. A small bump on the path of salvation the elders have set forth for us. Alright, but uh, you know, I had my concerns about bringing whatever was left in the barracks pretty much on this retaliation. And we flawlessed it. Having already surpassed some of our other soldiers' capabilities. Alright. Um, so, in the past, I've always been a big fan of lethal. Just, you know, get more damage to make sure you get killing shots, to make sure, you know, you, you trigger your, your battlefield awareness, your implacable, etc., etc. Reckoning, however, is such a nice mobility tool that, um, yeah, that's kind of become my, my go to pick. And with 13 AP remaining, so let's pick up Cutthroat. Oh. And also, yeah, talking about Untouchable, grab that. We destroyed a little bit of loot, but I think that was, that was worth it to make uh, the mission go smoothly. All right, so what was happening on the Geoscape? Uh, we have a bunch of missions up here. One, two, three. Um, yeah. With the Archon King on this one. This is going to be ready in two days, 21. This is going to expire in one day, 17. I would really like this to be easier so that we're not running this at strength five. So, I think I'm gonna boost this. So we can run this in one day six hours. Make the other missions easier by killing one point of strength. I think that's the smart play. Alright, yeah. Let's just go over, back over there. One Illyrium. We need some, some Illyrium from this and from this. And from what was this even? Oh, lip tree. Yeah. Yeah, we got some uh, high stakes mission here. Well, this is not necessarily high stakes, but we need we need supplies. We need stuff. Why you stop scanning? What happened? Rooted in New Chile, that's fine. Like, I'm super paranoid about missing one of these regions going back to 8, but they are, they're really down. Like, Western US down to 4, Chile down to 5, Indonesia down to 4. Ooh, good, this is more the concern. That this goes to 8 and then we could have an invasion here. But concern as in, yeah, we just flip to Intel to detect the supply rate before it happens. Alright. 16 to 18 troop column. But we have an almost full squad of master sergeants here. Handle to, uh, um, able to hopefully handle whatever's coming at us there. But we'll do that in the next episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.